whatever your name is going to be. This is how I found out about you. Your mother and I were living our lives, having fun. She met your father and they just hit it off, chemistry. One day, I was in your mom's bathroom with her, and she took a little test. We were sitting. We were sitting in the tub. Yeah, you were sitting on the tub. I was you were standing, standing by the counter. And then, how did she say it though? And then she passed it to me after, like. It's funny how you never truly know what you want until it's right there in front of you, breathing hard, almost hitting you in the face. A blind man realizing that he needs color. Hey guys. It's like a slap that wakes you up in the middle of the night when you're all alone. You're 15 weeks now. You don't know where it comes from, and it feels so real and important. Sometimes things just make sense. Now I know that's an oversimplification of what love is. It fits and it hurts at the same time. The crazy. true duality of the universe. The want of another person to go through this crazy yeah, journey. This is not the most fantastic okay, story so ever told. No wars were battled, no crusades undertaken. But its realness makes it. When you're 20 true. years old, I love the material. It's you're so just figuring out your life. You don't know what you want. You're an so indecisive you so teenager and you're just becoming a young adult. And there was one thing that your mom knew for sure, and that was you. You're super confident of the height as well. Do you hear those things? Those bugs? No. More to the side. She said, I have something to tell you, and I said, you're pregnant. <laughs> Obviously, I started crying. I was so happy. I was proud of her. I knew this is what she wanted ever since she turned 15. <laughs> I mean, and that's the thing is, is, and it's like I still get chills. So wait, only what? Twenty to what? Twenty pounds. You no, I mean for the for the whole thing. Twenty to thirty-five. Twenty to thirty-five. So yeah, eight more pounds. Do cardio. If you're gonna eat, you need to exercise. It's just in and out these days. Literally tastes like. Oh, it's the best. Can I tell you something? You never eat it. Don't tell me. Double cheeseburger. It's my time. And fries, well done, please. Do I want cheese fries tonight? Okay, right? <laughs> <laughs> right. Who got cheese fries? Kelly, did you get cheese fries? Oh, oh my god. Should we close the window? Yeah, just so we can fast in the room. Okay, so this is the baby's heart. These are the four chambers of the heart. Oh, I see the can you, I see can we hear the heartbeat? Yes. There's your grandbaby. Isn't that cute? Do you have any messages to the baby? I can't wait to like meet. What if she's like anti-makeup? 
I mean, I wouldn't. Or she's like, bro, like she can beat her face at age five. It's like one or the other. <laughs> it's like carving out the brow. She's like, okay. <laughs> I love you, and I love your mom, and she's going to take amazing care of you. Are you going to cry? <laughs> she's going to take amazing care of you, and you are one lucky girl to be able to call Kai your mom. Me and Heather are four weeks apart. I'm taking a little bit of credit because I... Me and Kim are four weeks, are four weeks apart. We used to talk about this as a joke like two years ago. I was like, Heather, you're here. And I was like, Heather, your next baby, wait for me. Ha <laughs> ha 